Good morning, boys and girls. Do you know what today is? It's Palm Sunday. But do you remember what happened on Palm Sunday? Jesus came riding on a donkey, and all of the people greeted him, thinking he was going to be a marvelous king, going to rescue them from all of their fears of the government, of the emperor, of Rome. But that wasn't what Jesus came to do. They waved their palm branches, shouting, Hosanna, God save us. But Jesus did come to save us in a very different way. He died on the cross for our sins, and that was his true purpose, which is why we'll celebrate Easter next week. But today we remember Palm Sunday, and we remember that even though there is a coronavirus, and even though it's sometimes a little scary that we're not at school, and, and that there's germs going around, God, save us, God saves us, and he already has the victory. He's already died for our sins, and he's still with us. He never leaves us, even when we're scared. In fact, he's there all the more because he's listening to us all the time. And that's what we remember today. And if you want to celebrate Palm Sunday like we would have if you were here, if you were here, we would have been walking down the aisles with our palm branches, praising God and asking him to save us, just like they did on Palm Sunday. Well, they didn't just use palm branches. They also used clothes, robes, towels, and they would wave them in front of Jesus. This is something you can do at home with your family. You can celebrate Palm Sunday with some clothes you have lying around in your house. And then they threw them in front of Jesus so that his donkey could walk on it. So if you're at home today, I encourage you to celebrate Palm Sunday, wave some clothes or robes or towels around, and remember that God does save us. He saved us on the cross. He will take care of us with this coronavirus, and he has an awesome plan for our lives. And all that believe in him will get to spend eternity with him in heaven, and that is what we get to rejoice in today. So thank you for joining us for our children's message from afar. God's blessings. Bye.